Hello, I'm Magic Al. And right now I have Maplewood Brewing Brownie Points. They are, they are brown ale with vanilla. I have reviewed. I have reviewed. Having trouble talking. I have reviewed Maplewood Brewing before. They are on Maplewood Avenue in Chicago. They came around in 2014. That's about all I know about them. This beer is like I said a brown ale it is brewed with vanilla this is what the can says about the beer they use two row Munich and biscuit malt for the grains two row workhorse malt Munich is an excellent malt it is used in a lot of Belgian beers um, it has a great mouth feel and biscuit malt is believe it or not a little bready when it is brewed up. We have flaked oats, which gives a nice smooth mouthfeel. So this is kind of exciting. And we have brown dehusk carafa. I have no clue what carafa is. I've never used this before in any of my brewing. Um, but I'm guessing this is where some of the color comes from because it is a brown ale. Um, the hops, Warrior Hops, it's an excellent hop, and Northern Brewer is a good workhorse hops. Um, it says Vitals on here. And the Vitals are 20 SRM, that's the color. So I expected a brown to be a little bit darker than 20 SRM. Um, 25 IBUs, which is good for this type of beer. The alcohol is 5.7%. So. That is this beer. Let us give it a shot. And as we pour it, it is a wonderful brown color. It looks darker than 20 SRM to me, but it is pouring nice. It has a good tan head to it. Almost an aggressive head. And I'm getting a nice roasted flavor from this, almost caramel flavor from a caramel scent from this. I say flavor, but it's a flavor for my nose. And a lot of that is the Munich um, malts with this. It's really good, this aroma. Yeah, I can smell this. This is coming out really good. A little, just a nice roasted malt, some bread, the biscuit malts, of course. Um, yeah, this smells like it's going to be a nice, smooth, full flavored beer. Let's give it a taste. And this tastes very much like it smells. There is a full flavor here. And because of the flaked oaks, it just rolls off the tongue. Um, there is a nice smoothness of the roasted malts that just rolls off the tongue. And it's got an excellent smooth mouthfeel. Mouthfeel, I cannot talk. It has a lingering finish. It is not crisp at all, which is common when you, when you use flaked oaks in a beer. The head is there still. It is a little roasted. Um, the vanilla is definitely there. I didn't notice it too much on the nose originally, but now that I'm tasting the vanilla, yeah, I can smell it. And the vanilla is a nice smooth finish. And that's really how this beer ends. It's just a smooth vanilla flavor rolling out. It is very well constructed. Um, yeah, I'm going to enjoy drinking the rest of this. I'll probably give it a good three stars on untapped. 
follow me and see what I've written for my review. I'm going to enjoy this beer now. Cheers. Cheers.